Coming to you straight from the Rio Grande and beyond. And beyond. Broadcasting to the four corners of the globe. So grab your seat, your coffee, or your sundowner. Okay, everybody, here we go. On point, as always. This is Gloves Off. Gloves Off. We're back at you in Gloves Off, and I'm Paul Buitron, and I'm here with a great living legend, okay? A great professor of savant, one of the best champions that came out of France, and a dear friend. He's Professor André Sabatier. Oi, mon ami. You doing okay? Yes, I'm okay. <laughs> how, is, how is France now with the pandemic? It's coming down? Uh, coming up. And, uh, <laughs> and the revolt also. Yeah. yeah coming, uh, up, up. It's the same thing here in the States. It's the same thing here in the States. Everything is going up. And I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen, but we have to have faith in God. Yes. Yes. But um, one question that I've always seen, because I've always seen a lot of greats of Sabbath, and you're one of them, okay, in my opinion. You're one of the, one of the not only, one of the professors that left a name in the fighting of the fighters of Sabbath was you, okay? And um, with that being said, how did you begin Savat? Como tu commence la Savat? Que tu regardes la Savat? Como tu entre dans la vie d'un Savatur? I began uh, Savat boxing uh, when I was uh, 15 years old. And uh, I discovered Savat with uh, local television broadcast. And uh, I wanted to to practice uh, martial art. Mm -hmm. First, I, I I I wanted to practice kung fu, but sure. uh, there there is not uh, a club next uh, to my, uh, my 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 home, and I I I I, uh, I saw. Uh, a Savat boxing club, uh, team ball, in my in my uh, next to my street, and I I, I began uh, I began uh, Savat boxing uh, with Jean Ribon. And um, to tell the people out there, Jean Louis Borg is one of the most honorable, most noble professors there is. One of a living legend, another one, a dear friend of mine, family. That's what it is, family. And John Borg, he has made tremendous contribution to Savat and has made great fighters like yourself, great saboteurs that he has produced. And that's, that, that, is, that is exceptional. Um, Por toi, ¿qué es la diferencia entre la Savat y los otros art martial? ¿Qué, qué tu regard? Porque todos los art martial, se como dicen, Tout c'est complet. C'est la différence de la savate pour toi. Quelle est la différence de la savate pour toi, de les autres? First, uh, I think uh, savate boxing is a, 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 a particular spirit. Not, uh, not uh, only for fight, for uh, also education of young, young people. And it's uh, very important to transmit uh, respect, uh, working out, uh, loyalty, uh, wrong, uh, right way of life. Correct. Yes, it 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 has a sense of. This, how can I put it? In Savat, you have a nobleistic attitude with streetwise sage behind it. 
Understand? Yes. Yeah. Le savoir, c'est de tout, c'est du, du roux, et c'est un peu noble. Tu comprends? C'est la, la, la différence. Hein? Um, la pédagogie de la savate, c'est différent de, de la pédagogie des autres arts martiaux. Um, when did you decide that you wanted to fight? How did, did you find out, you know what, I'm going to fight, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to try, I'm going to do? After six months practice of uh, learning uh, Savat, uh, my, my uh, teacher proposed me a uh, um, competition with an, an, another club, another team. And I, uh, I, I fought uh, against a French champion, but I did not know he was French champion. And uh, I, I lost the, the fight, but uh, I was uh, satisfied of me, of my technicals, of my uh, emotion. And uh, when his, uh, his, his coach uh, tell me uh, he's a uh, French, uh, French champion. Uh, so I, I, I eu un déclic. Really? Et, and I decided to train hard to become a real champion of, in my life. And you since did this, that? Since this day, I train hard, hard, very hard, every day. And I, I, I uh, began to uh, franchi des étapes step by step. Right, yes. And you became, you, know, you became French champion of Sabat. Yes. Uh, champion too. After, after, after three years of project practice. Uh, excellent. And um, you became um, in, in, in Savat. Which is your best fight that you can say, you know what, this is the fight that I gave everything to in Savat? Which is your most memorable fight or that you, that you said, this is a fighter that I have total respect for? I, my, my model was uh, Richard Silla. Yes. He, he was my, my inspiration to develop my technical, my, my practice. Yeah, for me, is uh, like uh, Sugar Ray Leona or Muhammad Ali or, or Fast Sabbath Boxing. You're absolutely correct. You know, Richard Sila not only was our trainer in, in INSA, you know, not only that, my, my brother under Paturel, because Paturel was my, my professor. Uh, Richard Sila, like, it's his family. He's a older brother, you know, and uh, yeah. and he taught us a lot. But Richard Sila to box Frances Savat is a Muhammad Ali to boxing because Muhammad Ali changed boxing completely. Yes. Changed the way people move, the way they produce the guard. He changed boxing completely. And... Um, Richard Sila did that. He changed, you know, the transformation from Box Francaise and Savat, and then they come together. Savat, Box Francaise, he was the one that pushed that forward. C'est lui. Je dis que c'est lui que c'est le premier uh, Savatou de la Savat, Box Francaise, complet. I think so. Yep. He, uh, le, je dis que le criador de la Savat, Box Francaise, la nouvelle discipline, no? Je dirais que uh, c'est Professeur Hervé Brolandé. Yes, yes. And Hervé Brolandé, you know, he bring out Richard Silla, Sylvain Postal, Pinacchio, Farina, Godfrey, and others, you know. 
And I think it's him that uh, produced what we, the pedagogy of what we have now. Yes, I think. Yes, he was a genius. I trained uh, with the, these guys and yes, with Briande. He was a good, good, very good coach. He changed with Richard Silla. The combination of Hervé Briande as a coach and Richard Silla as a performer, this combination changed the style of Savat, yes. the style of pra practice of Savat. Yes, you're absolutely correct. I agree with you completely. What um, a changing, um, you went from Savat to kickboxing and full contact. Explain that, how it happened. Um, I, I wanted to progress in other sports, but my, my uh, principal uh, ob uh, objective was Savat competition. But to, to, to progress, I, I fought, I fought in full contact in kickboxing, uh, also uh, English boxing to progress and to perform. Exactly, exactly right. Um, you became champion of full contact and, and kickboxing, correct? Yes, uh, uh, European champion in Marseille in uh, nine, 1989 and uh, one more one month after my uh, European Championship, uh, I, 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 they proposed me a world title against Danny Melendez in Portland, Maine. I accepted and uh, with uh, my coach, Jean-Louis Ball, we went to Portland and I, I, I I won this fight by TKO at second round. In the second round. And I'm putting the fight right now just so people can see uh, what it was. What do you remember from the fight? What did you see the difference? Did you see a difference in, in moving and fighting? And what was the main difference that you said that, that you could figure it out? Because it's a, you, you knocked him out three times with the same kick, which was a, a fuerte. Or Fuerte Mortal, no? Yes. Yeah, three times, not once. Three times you took him down. And uh, what do you think was the difference when you saw that in fighting and everything? Of, of this fight, I, I, I think I was uh, more relaxed. And my, uh, my uh, opponent was uh, very... Uh, tension. Just very and, tight. Uh, he, he wanted to fight me with English boxing. And uh, I fought with my technical savat, with mobility and uh, precision. So I gave him, uh, I hit him with my uh, free mortal. <laughs> First, the first Fuete was knocked, knocked, knocked him, and he was uh, very, very uh, a brownly. Yeah, yeah. And because you, you can see he was damaged. And in the second round, you took him down twice. Yes. So, uh, at this moment, I I uh, I know I I knew. I, I, je je savais qu'il fallait que je j'accélère et que je finisse. Voilà. Yes. Yeah. And it's 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 noted by the way you moved and everything else. And you, it was your fight from the beginning. A lot of people do not see the difference between savat and kickboxing. They think savat is kickboxing. It's a pugilistic art but it's not kickboxing. 
you know, yes. and uh, there's a lot of things. I think now with you all going to full contact and kickboxing, kickboxing has changed because saboteurs have gotten into kickboxing. Yes. So the a movement, lot of, not a, uh, a saboteur. A lot of fighters of savat boxing um, fight in cake boxing, full contact, and perform. Yes, and become perform. champions because yes. of that pedagogy. Why, why would you say that happens? Why would you say? Por que, por qua tu, tu di, di, por qua tu penses que la savat se, se, et le saboteurs ont dans cette discipline et tous gagné? Pourquoi que tu tu dirais c'est ça la raison c'est la pédagogie ou c'est quoi c'est la technique c'est pour moi c'est euh, un more complete technical technically complete with mobility uh, strategy distance uh, all the things I learn to to beginners to yes. young boys, and it's uh, they grow growing with uh, a lot of uh, panel of technical. Yes, yeah, I agree with you tremendously. You know, Savat in history of the martial arts, it has given more to the martial arts, and I can give you examples. And the martial arts have never said thank you to Savat. They have continued with what Savat has given to them, and they say this has been ours since the beginning. No. Um, during the Meti dynasty of Japan, a saboteur, which was a corporal, Le Grand, which was a student of the view Le Cleric, Book Francis Savat. Book Francis. He was sent to Japan to teach the Japanese officers how to fight in both senses. There's many, there's many pictures. And in that group, Sensei Funakoshi, the founder of Shotokan, was yes. learning both senses. Then later on, he, he produces Shotokan Karate, you know, because of that military training that he had. Okay. But yet there's no, there's no, Thank you, Savat, for helping us. But, you know, and uh, then it goes on. Um, Bruce Lee, you know, yes. you, see, you see his tunnel in, in enter, enter uh, the game of death. It's a Savat uniform. He was intrigued with Savat that he grabbed the kicks of Savat and he put the ideas into his Jeet Kune Do. Very noted. Again, there's no thank you for it, but it's there. Yes. The most one, and the one that was told to me by an old professor of Savat, uh, Silvan Salvani, who was one of the greats of, was that Judo, and Bob Alex says the same thing, Judo helped Savat from dying. The Judos grabbed it, and it was the Savat Judo Federation at one time. And the color grades of the glove were transferred over to the color belts of judo. Oh, uh, yeah. So it has given a lot to many, to capoeira and other, other arts. And, you know, and we give as saboteurs, like you, your, uh, John Louis, to the professor, they give. We don't expect a thank you. We give all the time. And I think that's the difference with that makes a saboteur from others is we we're going to give we're going to extend that hand to help others and it, uh, i think that's the difference to my opinion so yes always i give. didn't know i didn't know savat uh, inspired inspired uh, all of us are martial well, i don't know martial. if all the martial arts but a great many of them and there's it good is. documentation on it too um, you know, another French martial art you should know uh, is with uh, 
and you knew the, the Raza from Reunion Island, Moreng. You know uh, Rudolf Rendon, he does Moreng. Yes, yes. Where did Moreng come from? Chasson? Yeah? E Maybe. Exotic, exotic island. <laughs> <laughs> and they have Moreng. You know, uh, Martinique has, has, uh, has Damier, same thing, almost. They're French islands. But, you know, history goes. What The problem with the history of Savat is the problem is that it is oral. It is professor to student. It continues. Very yes. few have actually written down the history. And then we find out that sometimes we write down the history. It's a little bit different because somebody else has another. So we have to be very careful of how it's done. We have to be like investigators of, uh, of a police crime. You have several witnesses. Okay, that's a fact, you know? <laughs> <laughs> but uh, tell me this. How do you see Savat in 10 years, 15 years? How do you think? Do you think it's going to grow back up? Or what do you think is going to happen? Uh, I don't know, but... Uh... I think uh, Sabat uh, accumulated late, a lot of late uh, evolution for this evolution with media, with uh, uh, image, um, um, uh, old, old image, too old image. Right. So uh, the people like uh, modern, modern uh, art, modern fight, fighting art, like MMA. Yes. So, so I think uh, Savat, um, it, it, it will be difficult to, to, to growing. Yes. It's you're, my opinion. You're... No, your opinion is alongside mine. I think Savat was lost a long time ago, and it was, there's people that love Savat, you, me, others that love it, but you can't, we will continue doing it, but there's, unless somebody goes into MMA from Savat, Pope Francis, and knocks down everybody in MMA and says, I do Savat, it's not going to go well. I think uh, also uh, uh, a lot of uh, other uh, discipline, like savat, kickboxing, full contact, um, English boxing. They they will be in ten or twenty old uh, later. They, 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 they will be a dis, uh, discipline to complete MMA. Yes. I, I think. Because people will want, will, will want to practice only MMA to perform, to, 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 to win money, because a lot of money in MMA. There's a lot of money uh, all over the uh, uh, boxing the uh, boxing uh, system. Um, Savat, there's no money. Are very poor. Yes. Versus yes. Uh, MMA, MMA system, MMA competition. Yes. You are correct. You are correct. Let's talk about that fuete that you gave, the fuete mortal. Talk, <laughs> talk to me how you learned it, how you perfected it. When was the first time you saw that? I saw, I saw, I saw this technical uh, with a uh, low kick. And uh, many uh, fighters adapted the, the, the low kick uh, Jambe morte in 
high level yes. in a head head in high kick yes with the same technique jambe morte mm -hmm. and i train uh, with this technical in, in the bag all over the time all over every day i train with my right uh, right feet was my my uh, power fit <laughs> yes 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 and uh you know i've i've seen you do the fuerte mortal no sila si yes richard sila penacchio y richard toma those are the one the only three the, the only four that i have that that you see them you do all the time person will go down no yes and Richard Silla, when he fought uh, against uh, uh, Richard, uh, 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 Peter Cunningham. Yeah. He, yes, low kick, jambe morte. Right. A lot of low kick. Yep, yep. He gave. Yep. Now, Hopefully, hopefully, when the pandemic goes down and people can start moving, hopefully we'll we'll bring you here to Texas and express and give some to the to the crew that we have here. I think they will enjoy you teaching and the fellowship and bring that. Yes, I will. I will. I will be uh, uh, happy. Yes, we'll do. We'll do that. You know because. We have to continue maintaining that. Uh, um, it's kind of hard here in the States because they only see me. They have to see the others that are out there. And I think, to me, I think every professor of Savat is a piece of the puzzle. Every professor is important, and every professor is a piece of the puzzle of what Savat really is. And they all marry. Every Every pro, pro, every teacher of Savat has his, his own style, and uh, it's a very very interesting to to share technical. Absolutely, 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 and you could see that before. I would say nineteen ninety six. Before that. You can tell who the fighters were and what club they were they were from, just by the way they moved. Yes. In the last couple of fights that I've seen, you you couldn't tell. So everybody was A B C A B C one two three one two three, the same. But before you could see the styles that were different. You know, every club had a different style and approach, and it was beautiful to see. Yes, sir. in 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 uh, John Wilbock, uh team, the, the the style was uh, the chasse, chasse bas, yeah, chasse double, bas. double, do, 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 double impact of chasse bas. Two times. I train hard with, with this technical, with uh, his, his brother, uh, Thierry Borg. He was my, my first uh, teacher with Jean-Louis Borg, but the, the, for competition, Thierry Borg was my teacher. And he, he trained hard with chassé bas, chassé bas. Chassé d'arrêt, chassé d'attaque. Right. Yeah. Yeah, it's 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 uh, from Marseille right now. How many clubs continue with teaching Savat that you would say? I don't know because uh, since uh, I began to teach uh, and uh, since I began my my own club, uh, I stopped. To learn Savat, because my fighters wanted to to fight in full contact or kickboxing, so I decided to to stop Savat because 
there, 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 there aren't uh, no no interested to continue Savat. I think uh, to 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 com complicate with federation, with French federation. So. Uh, Yes, I stop. Yep, and that's uh, that's sad because the that's sad. You know, the federation has done its the federation has done its job in to destroy and dismantle Savat. Not only in France, around the world, they want to promote it, and at the same time, they're trying they bring it down. Yes, I've never understood that. You have good people, and all of a sudden, they bring it down. I don't know why, but I guess that's the way it is. That's the way it is. But the good thing is that you're continuing to take your teachings and your and your sabbat and making good fighters and moving them forward. Yes. Yes. And that's what you know what it entails. My brother, we've running out of time, but um, I want to thank you for what you've done to Savat. And I want to thank you for continuing to move forward with your teachings and with with this, with your Savat. You know, thank you. Oh, yeah. And we'll talk soon. And let's plan and see what happens maybe next year for you to come down. Okay? Let's, let's figure it out. I hope. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll do some stuff. If you see uh, John Louis, give yes. him a hug. Give him a hug and from, from <laughs> us. Okay. Okay. We'll see you soon. Yes. See you soon. Peace. Take care. Take care.